Man, um, I just seen, um, I think the other day I seen a fight with um, Regis Progress and and he was in that tournament. I don't know the guy he was fighting. I forget the guy names who, who, who he was fighting. But um, I did see Regis Progress fight before I seen when he um, knocked out in Dago. And I think I seen another fight with him. But uh, the other day I was really, I really had a chance to really sit down and, you know, really see um, how he fights, his fighting style. And, and you know what I'm saying? his approach and he's a pretty decent fighter man uh, I like his upper body movement he has a strong strong base with which he fights from uh, he doesn't mind um, mixing it up uh, he can box a little bit from the outside he kind of remind me a little bit of Shane Mosley a little bit of Shane Mosley not probably not as powerful as Shane Mosley was in, in that, those lower weight classes but he kind of remind me of Sugar Shane Mosley with the build the stocky build uh, the compact build uh, look like he lift weights a little bit there, but he's a pretty decent fighter, man. And um, I don't know everybody that's in the tournament. I can't pretend to know because I'm not really uh, paying attention to the tournament that much. But I will be going back and looking at some fights. But in my estimation, um, he probably should win this tournament. You know what I'm saying? And then probably be, you know what I'm saying, the undisputed at 140. Or I think he had three belts. I, I don't know if all the belts are in this tournament, but I think they are. But I got to re -go, go check again. But... He had the chance, if, if all the belts are in there, to be unscrewed at 140. So, and, you know, he had uh, had words with uh, Terrence Crawford. And, you know, Regis will be moving up pretty soon. I think if he wins this tournament, he, he probably will move up. You know what I'm saying? It, it, it will be nothing else for him to do at 140. Yes, he can stay there and, you know, rule 140 for a couple more years. But I think he will move up and, and, and you know what I'm saying, go get the money at 147. Cause that's, that's the money division, 147, 160. Those are the money divisions. So... I believe he'll move up. Uh, how will he fare against Terrence Crawford? You know what I'm saying? I will have to wait and see. But he will get Terrence Crawford some trouble because he's a guy that he's elusive. He's He, he is elusive. You know what I'm saying? He got, he has some great upper body movement. Uh, he looks strong. Uh, he, he looks determined, very determined. But he also got skill to go along with it. So to me, that would be a pretty good fight. But um, let me know what y'all think, man. Uh, Regis Prograde's. Uh, you know, me being able to analyze him a little bit further because that fight went deep, deep, deep round. So I was able to see him round after round after round. He was able to shut shut the guy down. You know what I'm saying? Every round looked the same with Regis mostly uh, dominating the round. And to me, that's a sign of a good fighter. If he can make every round just about look the same and him dominating the round, it's a, uh, you know what I'm saying? It's a good sign. But let me know what y'all think. Subscribe to the channel, man. I'm out.